Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. My name's Jen, and today I'm here with some five star TBR predictions. So I don't know if you can see in that thumbnail, but I am kind of starting to become overwhelmed. I've always been overwhelmed with my TBR, that's a lie, because you know, I've always been overwhelmed. But anyways, I'm starting to become extremely overwhelmed with my TBR pile at home. Um, so there are quite a few books that I really want to read in 2019 that I think I'm going to be giving five stars to. So the first of these books is Lifelike by Jay Kristoff. I have loved pretty much every single thing that I have read of Jay Kristoff's and I've given it five stars. So I expect that this one will also be a five star. I'm just kind of scared to read it because what if it's not? Um, yeah, really excited for this one and can't wait to read this in 2019 because I'm probably not getting around to it before then. Uh, next up is one that's been on my TBR for quite a while and that is A Darker Shade of Magic by B.E. Schwab. I've heard nothing but great things about the series and I just haven't gotten to it yet and I really need to. I've really enjoyed the books that I've read of, v. E. of Victoria Schwab's um, so far. I haven't read very many but the ones that I have read I have really enjoyed so really looking forward to getting to this. I'm going to make it a priority for 2019 to get this one read because I've had it on my shelf for I don't even know how long now and you know it's just been sitting there. Uh, next up is one that I had to pre-order this year and still haven't gotten around to reading it and that is War Storm by Victoria Aveyard. I have very high hopes for this final book in the series and I've loved all the other books and I just have the thing that I'm going to love this one as well. I hope. I don't know. I'm predicting I'll give it five stars but <sighs> really nervous about it. Next up is one by Kendara Blake and that is Two Dark Reigns. This is the third book in the Three Dark Crowns series and I've really enjoyed her writing a lot and I find that like each of these books has gotten progressively better so I'm really thinking that this one's going to be a five star for me. I'm, I think the first one was a five star. Um, the second one was kind of a little bit of a letdown but like I, I think this one is going to be another five star for me. Next up is another one that I pre-ordered and then didn't read this year and that is The Fates Divide by Veronica Roth. I really want to read this. Um, it's only a duology and I don't know why I haven't read it yet. I'm probably going to read this in January during the sci-fi month um, because you know it's sci-fi and I kind of have like a very small amount of sci-fi on my shelves so so really looking forward to this one and I'm really hoping that it does turn out to be five stars. Next up is one of my favorite authors and that is Brandon Sanderson and this one is Skyward and probably anything else that he releases or that I read by him this year I, I expect will be five stars but this one specifically I think will be five stars. Again this one is science fiction so maybe I'll have to make it a priority to read in January. Next up I have Another book that I was really excited for this year and I had to pick up and that is Muse of Nightmares by Lainey Taylor. This book is absolutely gorgeous and I loved the first book and I would be shocked if I did not give this five stars. Um, I really enjoy Lainey Taylor's writing and I just can't wait to finally dive into this and finish up the duology. Uh, next up is a book that I don't have yet. I'm getting it this week. That is Queen of Air and, and Darkness by Cassandra Clare. I am positive that I'm going to give this one a five star because I love Cassandra Clare. Her books are what got me back into reading after not reading for like six years. So I kind of have a little bit of a bias towards her and I can't wait to read that book. And then the final one that I am predicting that I will give five stars to is Kingdom of Ash. Uh, by Sarah J. Mass. Um, love this series so much and yeah I mean I know a lot of people don't love it but I love this series and I cannot wait to finish it finally so hopefully I can finish Tower of Dawn this week and then start this in the new year. I have a lot of books that I want to read in the new year. Um, so yeah I'm not going to pick those up because uh, they're heavy. Um, but yeah, those are some of my five star predictions for my that are on my TBR. Um, let me know down below what you've been meaning to read and what you think, uh, what you've been putting up that you think is going to be five stars. And I will see you guys later. 
Bye.